Hello, welcome. Today, let us have a construction based on chapter locus. Already, we have done few constructions in my last videos. Today, let us have one more. Your today's construction is construct the triangle ABC in which AB is equal to 6 cm, BC is equal to 4.5 cm, and AC is equal to 5 cm. Okay, so first bit construction of a triangle. Second bit construct the locus of the centers of all circles which touch AB and AC. Third bit construct the locus of the centers of all the circles of radius 2 cm which touch AB. Then hence construct the circle of radius 2 cm which touches AB. And is okay if we read like this we may not be able to understand well but let us do part by part first triangle construction you see construction of triangle ABC where three sides are given which side we have to take the, uh, the base and uh, so that it will be easy for us to construct the remaining things let us see here it is given Construct the locus of the centers of all circles which touch AB and the AC given. So, if we take AC as a base, it will be easy for us to construct this. So, let us have, let us take AC as a base. Okay? Let us take AC as a base. Then, you know, what is given? We touch AB and the AC. We can take AB or AC. A should be the vertex here so that it will be easy. So let us take AB 6 cm. Okay. Exact, exact measurements I cannot do. But I can give you rough idea children. Let us take, uh, think this one AB as 6 cm. Okay. Now, A to C, B to C are given. AC is given 5 cm, B to C is given 4.5 cm. Let us say that from A to C, 5 cm, we uh, cannot do, but uh, more or less like this, more or less arc. Okay. Then BC is 4.5 cm. More or less like this we get. Okay. From here to here 5 cm mark. From B to here 4.5 cm mark. At this point of intersection let us take as C. Now let me join AC. Which we have taken as uh, taken 5 cm. Let us join BC. Which is. 4.5 Exact construction I am not doing but I will be able to give you a rough idea. Now, so first bit construction of triangle is done. Second bit, construct the locus of the centers of all circles which touch A, B and A. See, that means already I taught you when, uh, means when I have explained you locus with some situations, this particular uh, situation I have explained you. The locus of the centers of all circles which touch AB and the AC is the bisector of the angle. The AB and the AC, the angle included by these two sides is angle CAB. The bisector of angle BAC is the locus of the centers of all circles which touch AB and the AC. That means, suppose uh, this is a circle like this I have explained you. So what happens when you will join all the centers, it will be the bisector of this angle. Just for your understanding, I did this. We should not draw this. Okay. So the locus of centers of all the circles which touch AB and AC is the bisector of this angle BAC. So let us bisect angle BAC from here give one arc, from here one arc. Okay. From here, one arc. Let us join this. This point 
let us join A to this point and produce. It is the bisector of angle in this. So let me name this x. So A x, okay. A x is the bisector of any BAC. That is the locus of the centers of all circles which touch A B and A C. Any point on this bisector, if you take and construct the circle, okay, it will touch the, having the radius. Um, from suppose this is the point you have taken from here to here. Suppose this is 1.5 cm, so it will be equal distance from A B and A C. Every point on this uh, on this bisector is equal distance from A B and A C. So. If you take any point on this as a center and construct the circle, you will get circle having the perpendicular from here to here as radius. The circles touch AB and AC. Okay. Your third bit is construct the locus of the centers of all the circles of radius 2 cm, which touch only AB. That means we. That means what? Once Like this, all the circles which touch only AB, all the circles which touch only AB at a distance of 2 cm. That means what we have to do is at A let us construct a perpendicular, so 90 degree from here one arc from here one arc. Okay, 90 degree angle. Why 90 degree angle? We have to construct this. We have to the locus of the points. The locus of the centers of all the circles of radius 2 cm is the line parallel to AB at a distance of 2 cm from AB. The line parallel to AB at a distance of 2 cm from AB. Okay, one this side, one this side also you will get. But in this case, construct the circle of radius 2 cm which touches AB and AC. AC is this side, but not this side. So this side we are doing. Now what we do is from here let us give an arc of 2 cm. Suppose this is 2 cm arc. Let me name this as y. Okay. And again here let us construct 90 degree angle so that you will get the parallel line, the line parallel to AB at a distance of 2 cm from AB. We can produce also. And let me name this. Let me name name this as Z. So for the third bit, Y Z is the required locus. Every point on this is 2 cm from AB. So the Y Z is the line parallel to AB at a distance of 2 cm from AB. So if you take any point on this as the center of the circle. With the 2 cm radius, it will touch AB. Okay. Hence, construct the circle of radius 2 cm which touches AB and AC. Already, I told you that every point on the bisector of this angle is at equidistant from AB and AC. Now we have done that every point on YZ is equidistant from AB and. The point of intersection of this area, bisector of the angle A X and Y Z is this. Let me name this as O. That means O is a 2 cm from A B and also 2 cm from A C. When I say 2 cm from A C, that is the perpendicular distance. So from O to A B and O to A C or 2 cm. So, if you take O as the center of the circle, we are given construct the circle of radius 2 cm, which touches AB and AC. Means this is a this point O. We have to take as center of the circle and taking 2 cm as radius, you have to construct the circle. That means if it if it is a perpendicular, it will touch like this. So, I cannot correct or do properly. More or less, you will be getting. Circle. This is the required circle. I hope this is clear to you. 
for the second bit first one abc is a required triangle second bit ax is a required locus third bit yz is a required locus fourth bit o is the center and uh, having radius uh, 2 cm when we construct the circle it touches ab and ac because every point on this is if it is straight from ab and ac and e on this is yz is line is a 2 cm from ab and o is a point of intersection of these two lines so when we take o as the center with radius 2 cm automatically it will touch ab and ac so this is the required construction hope this is clear to you so this is one more construction i have done for you so i think of three or four varieties i have done for you with some situations uh, how to draw the locus and all i hope this is clear to you only roughly i have done i am not able to do construct uh, by using the instruments try to understand and do okay thank you